Well, another great idea for Mother's Day is to make it an event full of family fun. Celebrity entertaining expert Mark Addison is here. He's going to show us how it's all done. Leave it to Mark to show you how to twist up French toast in ways that you never, ever, ever could have imagined and make Mother's Day so fabulous. Hi. Well, it's all oh, about hi. mom and celebrating mom. I have a fantastic mom. Right. And I remember when I was a kid, I would wake up extra early, like I did this morning, <laughs> go downstairs and quietly make French toast for my mother. It was Aww. my favorite thing to do for her. So I wanted excited. to bring it back here today, but it's done with a little bit of a twist. Uh -huh. So I've got some young, sexy versions of Look French toast and also some classic versions and then some great fun for the kids. You set it all up like it's a bar mm -hmm. and you, everyone can add what they like to it, make it their own. French toast bar is what you call this, French right? toast bar, yes. And so over here, let's start with the hot and sexy. Why not? Hot okay. and sexy. I okay. reinvented a couple of new classics like a croque monsieur. I call this a croque mademoiselle because it's a little <laughs> extra sweet with, all, with the French toast on the bottom. Uh -huh. It's ham, gruyere cheese, baked in the oven and then served with an egg or non-egg on top, so that's the Mademoiselle or that's the Louis. So. Okay. Sexy. Did I, I tell you, you it was sexy? You did say it was sexy. Okay. I and didn't realize this, the degree of sexiness. <laughs> this is a French toast jambalaya. So okay. I made French toast. I sliced it long ways to make it look like a sandwich. And oh. I've layered it with fresh spinach, sauteed uh, shrimp, mm -hmm. and then again, another egg on top. If my squeeze sauce of jambalaya and squeeze a little bit more extra sauce on top. You've got different sauces over here, obviously, for different mom's palates, It's right? a lot of different fun for a lot of, for everyone in the family. I've got chocolate sauce, so you can squeeze chocolate on top mm -hmm. of French toast, top it off with a little bit of whipped cream, a little lemon curd, and I call this a little lemon cream pie. So you squeeze this on top of some fresh whipped cream as well. Mm -hmm. Then I have nuts and berries, so you have a selection here of great fresh fruits, some almonds, you sprinkle those on top, and of course it's not done without a dash. Gotta have that. Uh -huh. A dash sugar. of powdered oh, yeah. sugar. And then for the kids, obviously they're gonna like colors, different Absolutely. things that are fun to get in have the kitchen, right? Have more fun right? with the color in the food. I have here a couple of layered sandwich style French toasts. Mm -hmm. So one of them is a classic peanut butter and banana with a little drizzle of honey. You can also use real maple syrup. Let's get in the real stuff. Let's not get the <laughs> fake thing fake. up in here. <laughs> and then I have Nutella, which is topped with different fruits. Nutella is a really great right. r chocolatey rich mm -hmm. um, flavor there. Kids love it too. Mm -hmm. And it's also healthy. So this is a great say. solution for the whole family and it's just my favorite thing for Mom's Day. Now we're going to move over to the drinks in just a second, but I know you were working for hours at this. Obviously, you I started a greater at 5 a.m. 5 a.m. Yeah. But the average family, the average kids don't have to work that long to no, get no, this no. done. No, no, no. You right? can actually prepare the French toast the night before okay. and reheat it and have all this ready to go. Okay, Mom, I just wanted to be extra special, extra fresh. She's, it's extra fresh. Extra fresh. <laughs> if there's a mom like me, she needs some, something to drink. You so, need a little bit of sparkle, and we've yes. got two solutions here for you. Of course, we have champagne, which is my favorite mm -hmm. thing. I love to serve champagne for Mom's Day. So, but what I want to talk to you about is let's lose the orange juice, no okay? Orange no juice. more mimosas. It's like boring. The bye. No, okay. bye. Let's All get right. something else more fun and infused. <laughs> so we've got a whole bunch of different fruit juices here. We have pear juice. We have apple juice. We have pomegranate juice. I also have some other squeeze bottle here with essences. There's an orange essence and there's what? a passion fruit essence. So you just squeeze a little dabble into the the glass. Where do you get this from? Like, where do you get your essence? You can get from? them from your your local gourmet stores. Like, Whole right. Foods has all this stuff. Gosh, all this stuff is. It shopped at your local grocery store. Nothing extra special. You just have to open your eyes to find it. See, what are you trying to say, Mark? Huh? <laughs> uh, yeah, well, my eyes have been closed Pay for attention. quite a while now. This and is a great this solution is a here. This non is the non-alcoholic version. So instead of taking <laughs> soda water and mixing it with fruit juice, again, uh -huh. boring, right. this carbonates your fruit juice directly. So this is called a twist and sparkle. Okay. I have in here white grape juice instead of wine, mm -hmm. so that's non-alcoholic. I also have pomegranate juice and a little bit of essence of hibiscus tea. And wow. I call this my hibiscus palm frizz. And you literally just twist the top, mm -hmm. carbonation. Okay, step back. Well, it's <laughs> yeah. completely sealed and safe. You let, make oh. sure you let it settle all the way down and you've actually carbonated your very own beverage and you're gonna see it looks just like champagne when you pour it into and the that glass. Was, that's a lot louder in person than it is on TV, I'm sure. That's why I was running in the other direction. But look, we gotta look at this, the cards too. These right. are your own special Mother's Day cards. This is, this is a template up. that I made and I call it the love timeline. It's all one card All here? one card, okay. it's like a big paper, paper doll side. string and I have these little heart templates you can download from my website and each one you can customize with moments and memories <laughs> Aww. from your mom and it's just it's a really nice way to, to say thank you for all the years you put up with me <laughs> <laughs> right <laughs> and some moms are getting longer and longer and I, longer I have to right? add a few more hearts on here <laughs> hey, yeah hey. I'm going around the corner you guys didn't think I was gonna drink. sit by quietly well, well, when I know there's cocktails I know you'll show up <laughs> so you gotta pour a couple just here, for us so we can share mm. so you gotta see run, this you gotta is run. this is fabulous, so fabulous. Mark. here try, check mm. this check yeah you want to try this one too you do not have to ask look how it sparkles just like real champagne Oops. Mark, thank you so very much. As My always, pleasure. it's a pleasure to have you here. Plus, you mm. feed us. Mm -hmm. Hopefully, this is all edible. It's totally edible. Great. We'll be right back. Happy Mom's Cheers. Day. Mm. Cheers.